Hi, I am Manveen Kaur and I scored an overall band score of 8 with a 9 in reading and 8.5 in listening, a 7.5 in speaking and a 7 in writing. So I am going to talk about my preparation for IELTS. For the reading and listening section, there is just a lot of uh, study material which is available on the internet and that really helped me a lot so you can also refer to it anytime. And for the writing section, I uh, went to the internet and read a lot of sample solutions which were already uh, present there. And also we were provided a booklet by IDP which really helped me as it had a lot of uh, mock tests which I practiced and it helped me to prepare for the exam. Tips for reading. I feel that reading is the most dreadful module and most people fear that reading is the most difficult one. But I would just say uh, the only tip which you can follow is read the questions before, before reading the passage and you can always highlight and underline any line or any passage which you feel that you would want to review after your test. And once you're done with all the questions, just spare some time to review your answers and check for any spelling mistakes. Tips for listening. Listening is uh, the most easiest module I feel as long as you're concentrating and focusing on the recording. Uh, before listening to the recording, just read the questions, especially the headings, because there are certain requirements which you need to fulfill for your answers. And uh, if you miss out on a question, just uh, don't, uh, spare, uh, don't spend too much time about it and move on to the next question. Tips for speaking. It is quite human to feel nervous before your speaking test and it was the same case with me but I just relaxed myself I drank a little bit of water uh, just keep uh, try to keep your voice loud and steady and uh, always feel free to ask the invigilator to repeat or clarify the question if you don't understand it tips for writing for the writing section I would advise you to start with the second task first because it contributes more to your overall band score and uh, it was it's my personal tip that after reading the question on a sheet of paper just make notes and draft all the points which you need to cover as it will help you to manage time and complete your test uh, quickly some mistakes to avoid during the IELTS exam for the speaking module it is uh, people believe that if you make eye contact with the invigilator then you are uh, more uh, then you might fumble and you uh, would you know you lose confidence but it's not true I would say that if you make eye contact with the invigilator it will actually make you feel more confident for the listening and reading I would just say don't spend and waste more time on the questions which you cannot find an answer to and just move on to the next question uh, and a very important tip for the writing module is do not miss the conclusion. It's the most important part, especially for the second writing task. And even if you're running out of time, just make sure that you do not miss the conclusion. The reason I gave IELTS is because I plan to go abroad for my higher studies. I did a lot of research on the other English language tests which were available, but I preferred IELTS over them because it is the most widely accepted English language test. My final advice to you will be, that just be confident, be relaxed, uh, believe in yourself and give your best. So I hope this video was really helpful and all the tips and uh, experience which I shared with you was also helpful to you. I wish you all the best. Thank you.